A Centerville High School student says she has been bullied by her peers her entire life. Well, now she's taking what she's been through and turning it into a positive through artwork. Two News reporter Maytel Levy is an example of what's working in the Miami Valley tonight. May. Well, this is some of Allie Fitzharris's artwork. She began selling it to raise money for an anti-bullying art contest she wanted to hold, hoping to end bullying in the district. People know, so they won't really sit with me. A lot of people ignore me. The halls are busy at Centerville High School, holding thousands of students. Allie Fitzharris is a freshman who says she's been bullied and pushed around because of her disabilities. A hard truth for her parents. Terry and Walt. I have been hearing this since Allie was in young fives because she was different and she just wanted to be included. It was hard for her to make friends and be invited to parties and sleepovers. Allie decided to be that change, losing herself in her artwork. When I have my music on and I'm drawing, it's like I'm in another world. I'm just so happy. She decided to hold an art contest for kids at eight of the elementary schools in the district, where she says the bullying for her started. My goal is uh, to just change of people's perspectives and show that bullying really happens in school and and use their art to help them go through it. Allie sold her own artwork like this piece to fund the art contest. It's just been so fun looking at all everyone's art. I can't believe I got like 111 entries. Allie picked winners at each school and presented them with gift cards. Even students who didn't win but submitted got a $5 gift card for some ice cream. A proud moment for mom and dad. And this is taking a positive step, not only to help Allie, but also to help other kids who may feel like they're um, being treated badly at school or anywhere. As for those bullies, Allie has a message. I do kind of forgive you, but it was wrong, and I'm in the never do that to anyone else again. Allie's parents are very happy with the way Centerville High School has been dealing with what's happened. And they're happy that Allie found a positive through art. They know that kids who are bullied sometimes have a tragic ending. They urge parents to talk to their kids about whatever's happening at school. As for Allie, she plans to hold that contest every year while she's in high school. Mates Hall Levy, 2 News, working for you.